In 2009, Satoshi gave the world Bitcoin. One of the key quotes that I often think about is when he explained that he did this so that we may conquer new territories for freedom. And because Bitcoin has such a stark contrast, such a stark alternative to the corruptibility of fiat, it has indeed conquered for millions of us new territories of freedom. But despite its immaculate conception and near perfection, it has always had a significant limitation. The lack of stability in terms of everyday prices that most people live their lives in. And as the years have passed, that limitation has grown more and more obvious. And today, what has filled the space between Bitcoin and fiat is a $140 billion market of stablecoins. Centralized, corruptible, dangerous stablecoins. But what if we could combine the best of both worlds, the incorruptibility of Bitcoin with the stability of fiat? In that case, Bitcoin would be able to do so much more. It would allow Bitcoin to be used for real world activity like never before. It would allow us to win a major battle and conquer new territories for freedom. Real world economic activity for real people. That is the promise of a Bitcoin dollar. So I'm excited to introduce a way for us to compete directly with central banks, a way for us to create a Bitcoin backed dollar I'm excited to introduce the Sovereign Dollar. Faster. Faster.